Hi friends, Miss Janet here from the Stovall Library. Welcome to story time. I hope you're ready for a good story. So let's start. We are going to start with these are my glasses. So I know we all have our glasses here. Just put your thumb and your finger together. Awesome glasses. These are my glasses and this is my book. I put on my glasses and open up my book. Then I read, read, read and I look, look, look. I take off my glasses and close up my book. Good job. And let's do open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. So open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. And now we're going to creep them. Creep them, creep them, slowly creep them right up to your chin. Open up your little mouth. Ah, but do not let them in. Good job. All right. So we are ready for a story. I have a story today. It's called My Bed. And it was written by Anita Bichsterbosch. Bitch Bichsterbosch, sorry. And it was um, published by Clavis Publishing. So we're going to read My Bed. So here we, we have a reindeer. And he says, hmm, time for a bed. It's late. Everyone is tired. Time to go to bed, reindeer says. Oh my, ah, reindeer sighs. But is this really reindeer's bed? Hmm. Oh, no, this is raccoon's bed. Good night, raccoon. There, he's all snuggled up in his bed. What about reindeer? Hmm. Found it, reindeer calls. Here's my bed. Do you think that's his bed? Let's see. Ah, oh, no. This is where mole and mole sleep. Good night, mole and mole. They fit in there just perfectly. Oh, this is my bed, reindeer says. Just look at how nicely I'm hanging here. Do you think that's his bed? Oh my goodness. Oh, no, mouse and mouse sleep in the hammocks. Good night, mouse and mouse. Have you ever slept in a hammock? Hmm. Oh, at long last. Reindeer yawns. This is so comfortable. There he is all snuggled in. Ah, oh, no, this cozy bed belongs to Fox. Good night, Fox. Oh dear, reindeer's, reindeer is having quite the time. Oh, here's my bed, reindeer mumbles. Oh, no, hair sleeps in the race car bed. Good night. Hair. Finally, reindeer cheers. This is my bed. No, Bunny sleeps in this bed. Good night, Bunny. Oh my goodness. Aha, reindeer calls. This is my lovely bed. I fit in it perfectly. No, Bear fits in this bed too. Good night, Bear. Look, Reindeer says, I found the perfect bed for me, but Owl is asleep in my bed. Oops, did Owl get in the wrong bed? <gasps> Hoot, Owl hoots, I sleep during the day. Now it's your turn. So Owl can sleep in there during the day and Reindeer can sleep there at night. Perfect. Good night, Reindeer. Thank you for keeping my bed warm, Reindeer says. And then she falls fast asleep. Oh my goodness, can you imagine sharing your bed with somebody who sleeps in the daytime and you sleep there at night? I don't know, but that worked out very good for Reindeer. He just had trouble finding his bed. That took him a long time. Oh my goodness. Okay, today just happens to be a snowy day. And so I thought this was the perfect book. It's called Good Morning Snowplow. And it was written by Deborah Bruss. 
and it was published by Arthur Levine Books. So we're going to read Good Morning Snowplow. Good night, homes, and good night, cars. Clouds move in to hide the stars. Good night, farms, and good night, town. Tiny flakes start twirling down. Good night, playground, turning white. Good night, snowplow. <gasps> Not tonight. Start the engine. Try the lights. Check both signals, left, then right. Fill the hopper. Test the brakes. Driver's ready, wide awake. Chains are down, time to go. Roads will soon be blocked with snow. Drop the plow. Extend the wing. Giant drifts won't melt till spring. Strobe on top sweeps round and round. Frosted branches touch the ground. So much snow. Waves of white curl off the blade. In its wake, a trail is laid. How's the road? A little slick. Salt and sand mix does the trick. Lonely plowing all night long. Tune the dial and sing a song. Windshield wipers keeping time. Washers squirt to clear the grime. Car approaches much too fast. Slipping, sliding, zips on past. Digging out will be tough going. Call the dispatch. Car needs towing. Uh-oh, he was going too fast. Wind picks up and whirls the snow. It's a whiteout. Take it slow. Watch the fl flags and feel the road. Push on with your heavy load. Everybody needs to drive carefully when it's snowing. Snow keeps falling fast and deep. Miles to plow before you sleep. Pay attention. What's ahead? Take no chances. Stop instead. That's a good thing to do. Step outside and look around. All is hushed, not a sound. Clean the lights in front and back. Hear what's coming down the track. Ooh, what's coming? Front light leading, barely glowing. Engine chugging, but not slowing. Cloud of white grows as it nears. Train blows by and disappears. So he was going chug, 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 chug. Scrape and salt and sand all night. Soon the sky is streaked with light. Wake up farms, wake up town. No more snowflakes swirling down. So the snow is done. School is canceled. Playground covered. Bright new day to be discovered. It's fun to go out in the fresh snow. Roads no longer buried deep. Good morning, snowplow. Time to sleep. That snowplow was plowing all night and in the morning, it's time to go to sleep. Tired out after working all night. Okay, I have my flannel board here and I have this guy here. He is, we haven't sang with him for a long time. He says, Old MacDonald, so you can help me sing Old MacDonald Had a Farm. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm, he had some chicks, E-I-E-I-O. With a chick, chick here and a chick, chick there. Here, chick, there, chick everywhere. A chick, chick, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a duck, E-I-E-I-O. With a quack, quack here and a quack, quack there. Here, quack, there, quack everywhere. A quack, quack, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Okay, let me take these down and we're gonna run out of room. And on his farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O. With a moo, moo here and a moo, moo there. Here, moo, there, moo, everywhere, moo, moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O. With a oink, oink 
oink here and oink oink there. Here and oink there and oink everywhere and oink oink old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a, who can tell me what that is? A turkey. E-I-E-I-O. With a gobble gobble here and a gobble gobble there. Here a gobble there a gobble everywhere a gobble gobble old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on his farm he had a horse. E-I-E-I-O. With an A-N-A here and an A-N-A there. Here an A there an A everywhere an A-N-A old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Good job. All right. Way to go friends. And that's all the animals I have here in this flannel board um, story. But you can keep on singing it with lots of other animals. Maybe he has a dog and a cat, maybe a frog. It can just go on and on. And you have fun singing about Old MacDonald. That ends story time for this time. So I will be back soon with another story. So long.